Hello everybody, this is Jyoti. Welcome to my channel, Daily Dose of English. To crack the IELTS CELPIP GRE or TOEFL examination, you need a good grasp of academic vocabulary. It is worth mentioning that you can score 25% to 30% of your marks through vocabulary. So in this video, you will be learning 5 best vocabulary words that you can use for your essay writing to improve your score. So if you are ready, let's dive right in. A difficult problem with no easy solution or a problem that is extremely difficult to deal with is a conundrum. Conundrum. It is an extremely broad term that covers any number of different types of situations from moral dilemmas to riddles. But let's look at some example sentences to make it more clear. So arranging childcare over the school holidays can be a real conundrum for working parents. Or another example would be when I am faced with a conundrum, I often ask my best friend for advice. To make something that is already bad even worse, or to make a problem, a bad situation, or a negative feeling even more severe, violent, or bitter, kind of like adding fuel to the flames, is to exacerbate exacerbate for example my headache started to exacerbate when my kids played loud music or another example would be because I do not wish to exacerbate my mother's worries I'm not going to tell her about my problems at work an event or period that marks the turning point or that is important because it represents a big change in how people do or think about something is a watershed. Watershed. So for example, year 2020 was a watershed year. Or you can say the year 2019 was a watershed in her life. She changed her career and remarried. Another example would be winning teacher of the year was a watershed moment in her life. Something that is extremely severe or harmful in its effect is virulent virulent so virulent disease or poison is dangerous and spreads or affects people very quickly for example janet has a virulent flu strain and is being kept in isolation at the hospital another example the firemen had to wear masks that would protect them from the virulent fumes. Something that is firmly established and difficult to change. Some ideas are so fixed or have existed for so long that they cannot be changed. So those ideas are entrenched. Entrenched. So for example, the internet. The internet is fully entrenched in the lives of young people. Another example, it is very difficult to change attitudes that have become so deeply entrenched over the years. Or the other example would be, the organization was often criticized for being too entrenched in its views. Okay guys, I hope you find today's video useful and if yes, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care.